Bye, everyone. Thanks for watching. Just going to shut this down. So thanks for joining us today. We're going to do a short uh, segment for anyone who's tuning in. If you're watching the replay, we really appreciate giving us two smiley icons. And if you're watching the live version, one smiley icon. So we're going to cover the topic, can you really wake up feeling and looking 20 years younger? So there's been a lot of media coverage in the papers recently on the TV on this particular topic. And so we're going to talk about an article that actually was um, in the paper. So before we get started, I'm going to introduce Dr. Kurt Fisnick. We have on the call here today with us. Kurt's been studying age reversal medicine for over 20 years. Uh, he's had his own practice in chiropractic and uh, he's very passionate. So welcome, Kurt. Thanks for having me on the panel. Great. Thank you for joining us today. And Trevor, uh, we've got Trevor on the call. He's really passionate about nutrition and age reversal. So if you'd like to introduce yourself, Trevor. Okay. Yeah, hi everyone. Hi friends and everyone watching this. Really excited about today. I'm looking forward to sharing our knowledge, um, particularly Kurt's, and uh, we're really excited about to be able to share this kind of information with uh, with everyone about age reversal and, uh, and about how we can stay a lot younger and live a lot older. Great. So I'm going to actually do a screen share now. We've got an article that we want to show you. Uh, here we go. So this article was in the Herald Sun, that's right, Trevor, a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, that's right. Yep. Yeah. So I'm just going to read a bit of this article. We want to really connect the dots for people here. What are they actually talking about? Because it sounds quite unbelievable turning back the clock. Uh, too good to be true, really. Um, so this is talking about a remarkable breakthrough that Australian scientists could see ageing bodies reprogrammed to feel 50 years younger. So in a world first, a team of researchers led by the University of South Wales and Harvard professor David Sinclair has developed a reprogramming process that can regenerate, that could regenerate the human body. So this article uh, really goes into a lot of detail and it's really talking about um, some research done in 2017 showing how that uh, a derivative of uh, nicotinamide mononucleotide can actually reverse the decline in blood flow to tissues and organs associated with age and improve it, the exercise endurance of old mice by 60%. If it works in humans, it could be the equivalent of giving a 70-year-old human the abilities of a 20-year-old. So this is pretty uh, remarkable uh, information, um, quite unbelievable. But although uh, we've been um, exploring this topic quite a lot, and the ingredient that they're talking about in this particular article, Trev's actually had quite a bit of experience with, and he's been using it himself um, as well with himself and his partner. So, Trev, do you want to tell us a bit about your story? Yeah, for sure. I, um, I must say, like, when we started learning about this new science, like, it hasn't been around for very long, and now we're seeing it hit the papers, So, um, which is quite good to see, really. It's been on a current affair as well and a, a number of other papers around around Australia. But, yeah, yeah when, when I first heard about this um, this science, I thought, oh, wow, it sounded too good to be true. And uh, anyway, I was quite sceptical about it, really, because it just sounded so far-fetched, really. But anyway, we were lucky enough to get onto a, a natural derivative um, product in the form of nicotinamide mononucleotide. Yeah. But, um, uh, my partner, my partner, Shah, she suffered from an autoimmune affliction. And uh, even though we, uh, we had fantastic results using minerals and antioxidants and um, using forms of uh, seaweed that could help with inflammation in the body, which really helped her immensely, really, uh, we got onto this um, kind of technology here to, to, to help the body to, to repair. And... Um, Shah's form of autoimmune stemmed in the aortic arch and it was a very rare autoimmune. And uh, what, what it did was actually create inflammation in the aortic arch, which meant that she had no blood flow or well reduced blood flow to the arms and, uh, and carotid arteries to the, to the brain. And, and they actually call it pulseless disease. And, and this disease um, was picked up when she had a, a very minor hernia operation. Mm -hmm. And they, they did some investigation and found that she had this autoimmune. So um, basically, uh, when we got together as a couple, I, 
you know, I learned about her problem and, uh, and I wasn't happy about the fact that she was on meds and things that were really about just uh, suppressing the immune system. And for me, that wasn't really good enough. So we, we were on this journey of trying to find ways of uh, helping with the inflammation in the body and uh, hopefully uh, helping with the problem. Anyway, we had great results. Uh, and when we come across this uh, new technology, uh, she, she obviously went on it. And uh, what happened was, was quite amazing because uh, for eight years, she could never get a detectable blood pressure read in her arms. And um, lo and behold, she went on the, this, this technology, this science, and uh, she ended up getting a, 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 a pulse back in her arms. Eight weeks later, we started getting a, a minor like blood read, blood pressure read in the arms, and it's actually gotten to the point where it's improved immensely. So you know, Kurt, can I just interject there just for a second, Kurt. When you heard that, weren't you driving with your son, who's a doctor, and and you heard about her finding the pulse, and he pulled over and said, "Is this for real?" Yeah, my my son is in his uh, third year of med school, and he was just really actually studying the disease, and uh, and he he really did. He was he was just totally amazed. That your that Char was able to get her pulse back because he'd yeah. never heard of that. Right. Yeah. So what been so fantastic about going down this route was that you know the prognosis of this disease that she had was wasn't a real good one, and it actually got her to a point where um, she was off all the medications, which was just fantastic, really. And um, now her vascular surgeons who have been doing all sorts of Doppler ultrasounds, you know, checking out the vascular system and seeing whether there's been any progression in the disease, have turned around and said that um, her disease has fizzed out, which is like just fantastic, you know? So it's just totally changed the, our whole outlook. It's just awesome, yeah. Yeah, incredible. Okay. I remember talking to you, Trevor, it was a pretty dark time when it was at its worst and, you know, staying positive and getting on top of it. Well, what yeah, it yeah. But, but for me, you know, for someone who hasn't got any health issues whatsoever, you know, for me, it's been fantastic. Like I can, I remember telling you, Kurt, like my, um, my vision's improved, um, from my peripheral vision's improved, my night driving skills, you know, I was getting to a point where I was lacking a bit of confidence because I couldn't see properly at night and I can now see better clarity and thinking. Um, I actually really do feel younger. And I just spoke to Shara about it this morning. I said, well, how do you really feel about it? You know, what's it done for you? And she says she just feels happy. She's got a lot more energy. Um, she says, you know, less feeling like you couldn't be bothered. So, you know, um, and it's just been awesome, really. I just feel great. I just feel really great. And Kurt, you've right. been radiant. How have you been feeling? Uh, you asked me? Yeah. I was saying, so you've oh. also had experience taking the same ingredient. How, what's your been your experience with it? Yeah, you know, I'll tell you, I actually heard about the ingredients. Uh, it was two years ago. It was actually a year before the age pill came out, before the anti-glycation extreme came out. I was actually, I was actually at a convention. Um, it was the uh, radical, radical um, um, uh convention against anti-aging and uh, again against aging and, and death and they were talking about this uh, science about the nicotinamide riboside and the nicotinamide mon mononucleotide and I thought holy cow this this sounds amazing so I started ordering the ingredients separately and I started taking the products it was two years ago and I noticed right away that I started feeling better and then when when Tom came out with the uh, with the product with the with, that we have now, I mean, the, the formulation is so much more powerful. And like Trevor was just saying, I could, I could see better. Um, I was telling a gentleman last night, I don't even know where my reading glasses are anymore. I mean, honest to God, I don't even know where they are. I haven't used them in a year. Wow. I haven't used them in a year. I'm, uh, I'm uh, uh, 56 years old. I feel like I have the memory I had back when I was going to school for engineering. Uh, people can tell me things. I remember it. It's, uh, it's, it's a blast. I love it. Yeah, mm. it's awesome. I mean, just fantastic science and, you know, it's just awesome to get these results. So I'm going to share uh, another, a couple of pictures actually, Kurt, if you want to talk through them, because I actually found these really remarkable. Um, let me just see if I can get them. This is one, this is a friend of yours, isn't it, Kurt? Um, this gentleman. Right. And, and what I found, and, you know, and people look at the photo and they say, oh, well, you know, is it the same person? He's got a lighter tan and, 
in one, he's, you know, lighter in one and darker in the other. But, uh, you know, he's, it's summer and he's obviously been out in the sun and he can well, being his background. But uh, what was particularly interesting to me is that if you look at his skin changes, I mean, he's pulling the same face, but look at the lines on the forehead and between the um, the eyebrows and on the cheeks and stuff. I mean, I mean, can you see this? This is remarkable. He's a friend of yours. You've seen it, and you've seen it. Um, it happened to him. Right. I mean, when you look when you look at his skin tone, you look at the just the the the, the firmness of the skin. You can see that the pores have tightened up. Um, everything about it, it just, I mean, he looks younger. He looks like he's reversed his age just in, in these two photos. He's looked like he's reversed his age five to 10 years. Yeah. How long has he been on the product for, Kurt? Any idea? How long has he been on it? Hmm. Between these photos? Um, boy, I, I, I'd just be guessing if I gave you an answer. Okay. No worries. Yeah, and then there's one more here. And this one's incredible. So, Kurt, when we're talking about this ingredient that they talked about in the article and, you know, really turning well, I mean, this is a gentleman who's been taking uh, this for a year and look at the difference um, in color. The bottom picture is obviously where he started and now the top picture is a more recent. Look at the change in color. So, you know, what, what can you, what's your take on that? I mean, that's just unbelievable, right? Um, that it's actually changing the color. And, and uh, I, was, I was at the vet today with my black lab and uh, the veterinarian, uh, when I told her that my dog was 10 years old, uh, she, she just, she couldn't believe it. She said she, first she looked in his mouth and she said, she said, well, his teeth, he looks like he's five years old based yeah. on, on the health of his teeth. And, and I, and I told her, I said, so I've been giving him this nicotinamide riboside product. And, and she, she just was like, wow, tell me more about that. I need more information. Yeah. I mean, I was so thrilled about these results. You know, I even gave it, started giving it to my dog and I'm having the same experience with her you know and she, she's really going well being 15 years old that right. did a, a check took her bloods said she was in remarkable shape for her age incredible so yeah just thrilled so i guess um we've covered quite a bit with the article and really the science and so the topic today was really you know can you really wake up feeling younger feeling 20 years younger looking and feeling 20 years younger looking and looking and feeling exactly yeah and so whilst, you know, that's really not going to happen overnight, like this gentleman here, it's a slow progression. So maybe, Kurt, just in wrapping up, why is it a slow progression to really have the effects of any type of age reversal or, you know, seeing that kind of thing? Right. Well, when you take a look at, at the nicotinamide uh, mononucleotide and nicotinamide uh, riboside, and just even niacin, because they're all, they're all various forms of, of niacin, what happens is, is that, um, it works with, uh, with the stem cells. It pulls the stem cells out of uh, senescence. And, and just an easy explanation for senescence is, is hibernation. The stem cells are in hibernation. So you're pulling them out of hibernation. You're removing that glycation and lipofusion. And you're allowing the stem cells to, to do what they're supposed to do, which is repair the body and, and, and keep us young and keep the, stel the cells young. And, uh, and as we age, the, the cells just tend to kind of go into the senescence. And so the, what, the, what the science shows is that it works to reverse all that. And that's what you're seeing with uh, Trevor's testimonial. Um, you're seeing it with, with our dog's testimonial. And, you know, dogs, they, they don't have a way of, of doing any kind of uh, a placebo effect. That's what I like. And yeah. uh, Greg, what did and, you say about dogs? Big pardon? What did you say about dogs before? Oh, dogs don't lie. <laughs> dogs don't lie. Hey, um, right. just a question, Kurt. Like, you know a lot about the science and you, you mentioned advanced glycation endo products. Can you just tell us about why this stuff's working just quickly in, in a, you know? Well, I mean, while? think about it like this. I mean, a lot of people ask me about, about glycation. They say, well, what is it? Right. And we can get into a lot of science, but most people hated science in high school and they hate it now. And so you don't want to you don't want to explain it in terms of science. But the easy way to explain it is really like this. If I've got a piece of fish and I'm going to throw it in the frying pan, I'm going to I'm going to roll it in some flour. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to get the, the flour so it sticks to the fish. And then I'm going to throw it in a frying pan with a lot of a lot of oil in the frying pan. So what happens is the hot oil makes the makes the. Um, the, the carbohydrate, the sugar, the flour, it makes it turn into a, into a, into a crust that, that 
envelopes the, the protein, the fish, and it sticks to it. Well, in your body, we have this constant oven that's burning all the time. It's our body temperature. It's burning at a low temperature. And what it does is it does the same thing. So when you eat a, a carbohydrate, when you eat that whole ho or that piece of bread or whatever, whatever it happens to be, anything that converts into a sugar, what that does is that the temperature in your body causes that to stick like a crust onto the protein. Wow. And that's why they okay. And so the product, it, what it does is it, it's like you go into the restaurant, you order, you order the fish and you peel the breading off, but then you eat the fish, but you don't eat the breading. Well, that's what, that's what the, that's what the product's able to do is able to remove that, that breading off your, off your cells, especially the stem cells. So as we age, we get like a, um, a build up a gunk in the body is what you're saying, really. Is that right? Exactly. So this has got the ability to break down that gunk and release it and help our stem cells to reactivate themselves like senescence, like you said. Right. Yeah. I'm working with a couple of stem cell clinics right now, and we're finding that we get better results when we put people on these products beforehand. And if we follow up with these products, we find that the patients respond that much, uh, that much better to the, to the, to the actual treatment. Well, well that's great. Um, I'm really excited that you guys could, uh, join us today and that we're on Trev's page and for anyone who's watching the replay or watching us live if you if you're keen to leave a comment please do and uh, Trev will get back to you with any information so I guess we're going to leave it there we're going to do another one in another week and uh, thanks everyone for watching and joining us today we really appreciate it thank you everyone thanks Kate Katie thanks Kurt see you mate